Hero Brewing Company here, and today we are going to do another uh, beer vlog, um, which is what I do, in case you've seen my other videos. So basically I like to try a bunch of a specific type of beer before I try to make it. Uh, I got um, a lot of beer videos, so make sure you check those out. But today we are going to be trying Puerto Rico um, Ale Brewed with Coconut. So it's a coconut porter, basically, because you can figure that out the Puerto Rico. Um, it says, let me show you the bottle. It's got a coconut. And then it has it's this is by Arcadia Ales. Right there. Got the nice little uh, Trinity thing up there. H handcrafted and bottled by Arcadia Brewing Company, Kalamazoo, Michigan. Uh, 5.5%. Established 1996, <clears throat> and that's all you get from that. So, uh, um, in case you haven't guessed, I'm doing porters, um, and also coconut roasted uh, stuff in the uh, my brews. Right off the bat, upon opening it, you get like a whiff of coconut, uh, which is really cool. That toasted coconut. Um, Odor is amazing. Not in this, and just in general. So. You can taste toasted coconut. It's a really dark. Um, I would say it's almost a black. It's a dark brown, almost black. And you get the toasted coconut odor. So the first taste that enters your mouth is almost like a uh, an aggressive um, uh, let me see. it's almost like an aggressive uh, nutty taste, but then you then you taste the coconuts afterwards which almost kind of tastes like uh, toasted marshmallows in my opinion or uh, um, like a s'mores type aftertaste but the first taste was really really strong of just kind of that yeah piney that's the, the word I was searching for piney an aggressive piney taste and then you get a toasted um, coconut aftertaste it's so dark um, it it doesn't really taste like a porter. It's kind of in a class of its own, but I'm going to grade it in the porter class. And then I'll also, uh, it'll be the same number for my coconut class of beer. Uh, so basically, um, out of 100, 100 being the best, zero being the worst, I would give this in a, uh, in a coconut and a porter, um, I would give it a, uh, a 65. Okay, it's not awesome, and you can't taste the coconut throughout, uh, nor does it really taste like a porter throughout. Um, it just is kind of in a uh, class of its own in that taste, um, I would say. So I wouldn't, if I was to name this, um, now I like the niche uh, name of Puerto Rico, but if I were to name this, um, it would be something that did not have the name Porter in it, so you wouldn't be expecting that taste and then getting this. Um, so I would just go like uh, Coco Bango or, you know, something more focused on the coconut rather than uh, Puerto Rico. And I do realize that there's a coconut on it. I get it. But the name is misleading for the taste. However, if you look at it, yeah, that's a porter. All right. So I would buy it. Again, um, now that I know, you know, not to expect a porter taste, but go try um, a new beer you haven't tried before. Go find something new you have not found, you haven't even seen before. Go try that. Uh, what is your favorite um, porter? What's your favorite coconut? 
put those in the comments. Subscribe, like, uh, share it, um, my channel, and to that, together we can all learn. All right. All right. Cheers.